Hello everyone, today I will give you brief information about Skoda Superb 2024. Please subscribe to our channel and like the video. Skoda introduced the 2024 model Super B. The car, which has sedan and station wagon body types, has seen very minor changes despite being a new generation. Czech automobile manufacturer Skoda, which continues to work within Volkswagen, introduced the fourth generation Super B at an event it organized. Skoda Super B which will be available in sedan and station wagon body styles, seems to be a good alternative to the Volkswagen Passat. So, what features is the new generation Skoda Super B equipped with? Let's start with the exterior design of the vehicle. To be frank, the 2024 model Super B has not seen a huge change in terms of design. The appearance with a vertically designed shutter at the front is generally preserved. The car, where very minor touches were made in the headlight design, has sharper lines on the lower bumper. The new Super B appeared as a slightly tougher model. When we look at the rear of the vehicle, we encounter a design that really manages to impress. The chrome details on the current Super B have been removed. We also encounter a largely renewed backlight design. For those wondering, let us state that this car will be offered with wheel options between 16 and 19 inches. When we move to the interior of the vehicle, we encounter a simple but modern structure. The new Super B has a 10-inch fully digital display screen. The infotainment screen on the center console varies between 10 and 13 inches depending on the hardware option. Skoda also announced that the Super B will offer a heat-up display option for the first time. The company, which preferred leather upholstery in the 2024 model Super B, did not skip the ambient lighting detail. In addition, features such as regional climate control, massage support seat option, and 14-speaker sound system are also available in Super B. When we open the hood of the new generation Super B, we encounter multiple options. The 1.5-litre 150hp gasoline engine will only be available in front-wheel drive versions. Those who need more power can choose the 2.0 litre 204hp option. This option is also front wheel drive only. Let's say that the last option on the gasoline front is the 2.0 litre 265hp version. This engine option will offer a four wheel drive system. When we look at the diesel side, we see 2.0 litre engines with 150hp and 193hp. The powerful option provides four wheel drive. By choosing a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission in all these engine options, the company seems to have enabled consumers to find the most suitable option for them. In your opinion, can the Skoda Super be a replacement for the Passat? Thank you for watching our video so far. Subscribe to our channel and like our video.